a three ingredient cookies and cream cake. So I'm gonna start with making the topping. And this is actually an optional topping. So it's a chocolate ganache, it's only two ingredients. Then the actual sponge cake is the three ingredient part. Gotcha. So I'm gonna start by pouring, is this hot? No? Yes. <laughs> and then, so I'm gonna- The handle's not hot. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's I was just right. gonna check. Right. So I'm just gonna start by pouring the hot cream over the chocolate. And that's just going to let dark it know. Yes. It's dark chocolate, yes. So you want at least 50% cocoa in it. So I'm literally just going to let that sit, and that's going to melt the chocolate. Then I'm going to give it a stir. So whilst that sits, we'll move on. And this is the first bit of the cake. So I'm going to start, well, we've already started, by separating the Oreos. So I've got a bowl of the cookies here, and then a bowl of the cream. And then I'm going to basically pour the cookies into the food processor. Go for and it. blend them into a nice crumb. It smells Looks good, good to me. Oh, smells like Oreos, I baby. I it's so good. Okay, so pour it into the big bowl. Thank gotcha. you very much. Sure, 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 of course. Next thing that gonna, is going to go in is a teaspoon of baking powder. So that's all in. And I'm just going to whisk this together. So it's fully combined. Great. So now that's in. We're going to pour in the milk. So this is about room temperature. You can even have it slightly warm. You just don't want it to be freezing cold. Gotcha. So that goes all the way in. And then we're also going to pop the cream in. You know what I just forgot to do? Let's do that quickly. Take a little bit out. And that's just going to oh, be the decoration. For the, right, the you little... You don't have to. The little flourish Yeah, the, the, the little bit around the edge. So Should I, just I add gonna, this to Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chuck so, that in as well. Note to you guys, when you're taking apart the Oreos, don't do what you know you do and do this. <laughs> yeah, you need that Because it needs to go back in, right? right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Sometimes half of mine only goes in. <laughs> right, exactly, exactly. You know I'm telling you the truth. <laughs> Okay, so then, yeah, literally, we're just gonna whisk it until everything's really nice and smooth. So then you're just gonna get, it's quite a runny batter, but it should be smooth. Perfect! And then what's going on with this? Okay, so we've lined it, we've greased it as well. We're gonna pour it into there. And this is actually a silicone mold. And that's because we're gonna be baking it in the microwave today. You actually can bake it in the oven. It's quicker in the microwave though. And also, not everyone has an oven sometimes. It, or the microwave's easier sometimes. So that's, that's the aim of the game. Okay. Can, can you open the doodad for I me? I can indeed. And how long do you pop? him in here for? So it's going to go in for about six to seven minutes. So let's start with six and then we'll see how we get on. All righty. Okay. And through the magic of television. <laughs> Ta-da! Pretend it's made awesome. earlier. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now the cream has melted our dark chocolate. We're just going to mix Spat it. Too, in case you want it yeah. to slather. Very much. So I'm just going to mix that all together. So that's going to go onto our lovely cake. <laughs> I know, Smooth stupid, that right? Out. Gorgeous. Oh, I love chocolate ganache. It's such a nice topping as well. I always think that if your cake doesn't look great on the top, just stick a chocolate ganache on it. It fixes everything. It exactly. really does. <laughs> it fixes every imperfection. Uh, thank you for joining us. This is a really lovely book that I just got a little bit of heavy cream <laughs> on. Cream on the book. <laughs> but everyone here gets a copy with no cream stain. <laughs>